Welcome back, everybody, to 7 Days of Now. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are picking up right where we left off in the last episode, where we're going to do this Tier 2 Fetch and Clear here at the farm. So let's get started with this. Uh, we don't have a whole lot of time, so we want to we wanna get cruising on this right away. So let's go in here. Is that door workable? Any zombies in here? Oh, yeah. All right, come here. I was thinking, you know, now that we have the armor... That I might transition to uh, sledgehammers because sledgehammers are my favorite melee weapon in this game. Um, so yeah, we're hungry too. By the way, I do have food back at the base, but I want to kind of see if we can get this knocked out um, before nightfall. So let's just move as quickly as we can, and you know, see see how things go here. So this is a clear quest. So we do need to clear the area. We're not going to take scrap iron. Oh, we should probably put our armor on, you think? Yeah, that'd probably be a good idea. All right. Now we're going to move a little slower, but we have we are much better protected, too. Did we ch check this? Yeah, we already did. Okay, so this, uh, yeah, this is a clear quest. It's this farming place. So let's go in and just... Get it knocked out as quickly as possible. I guess we go down through here, eh? This is interesting. Uh, okay. And then up through this area here. Ah! All right, we took a couple of hits there. I think what I want to do is... I want to really save these because, they I mean, these are so valuable... Uh, yeah, let's go ahead. Let's go ahead and take these now. And then we'll counter it with a couple of these. Counter the thirst effect, that is. We are really not so good on stamina, though, because we're hungry. Uh, which sucks, but what can you do? Let's just keep moving and see what happens here. We're moving up a conveyor belt. Interesting. Oh, where'd that come from? Oh, shit. I don't know where that came from. Let's at least get in the corner here so nothing's surrounding us. Oh, this is a clear and retrieve. Oh, okay. Where are you at? There you are. Oh, wait. Are you going to get up here or what? What are you going to do, man? Oh, you're in crawling mode. Yeah, I'm not so impressed with that. That seems to be kind of broken on these zombos. They're little crawling thing that they do he's probably about ready to die with all the bleeds on him yeah there we go okay let's go down here really quick there's a locked door that we can't do anything with okay so we'll keep going up this way another one. Oh, two more okay this is uh kind of not a good situation uh just gonna throw that out there See if they get derped out on this again. Oh. Okay. Um. Yeah, this these conveyor belts seem to really me be messing these guys up. Okay, we got him. There we go. All right, let's keep moving up. We better take one of these. Hate to do it, but, you know, I don't want to die. <laughs> That's all there is to it, man. Is this easy to break? It just goes out there. Okay. The thing that's a little tough about this POI is that there's not a lot of places for me to... Uh, you know, block the Zeeks from getting to us. But that's a, that's kind of neat, though, too, because it just changes things up a little bit, right? From the usual. We could have some buzzard action out here, so we need to be careful of that. And we still have to keep going up higher to get to our, our loots. So that looks like it just goes back down to the ground, so let's get up here. I want to get this ready in case we do have buzzards. 
And since that was unloaded, we better check everything else, too. That's loaded, that's loaded, that's loaded. This, uh, here, let's put this on here, too, and that's loaded. Okay, let's go. Let's go. And now it says the satchel is down lower. Hmm. Okay, let's get up here. I don't see any vultures. So let's go this way. Guess we'll go down here first. At least we have some doorways now that we might be able to utilize. Nobody behind. Oh, shit. Oh, there we go. They're dead. Let's close that. Okay, that door's locked. And that door's locked. Let's get the um the cobblestone here. We need to make a few more frame shapes. So what do we got? Five, let's make fifteen so we have twenty. I don't see any buzzards. That's locked. All right. I guess we go this way. Those are all locked. Um, I could probably jump that, but let's not take any chances. That's locked, too. I don't see anything up there. Guess we're supposed to jump down there, maybe, and go across that board? Okay. That's a bit of a jump. We could potentially hurt ourselves doing that. Hmm. All right. Well, here we go. <clears throat> okay, we're good. We're good. We got this. I will take those. Don't really need the stone. We got lots of stone. Shenanigans, man. Total shenanigans. Really? Ah, oh, shit. Okay. A thousand hit points. Now I wished I had my pick with me. And 10,000 years later, boom. All right. Wasn't quite 10,000 years. That gets us on this side. Okay. Get up on the pipe. Close that door for a second. There's multiple Zeeks, so we're going to actually upgrade this one. Oh, nice hit, buddy. Okay, let's just break this one out. It's going to be easier. We got thumped a couple of times. And we don't have any stone. Can you believe that? <laughs> oh shit! I'm gonna have to. I'm gonna just start carrying my pick with me. It takes up a couple more slots because then we need a hammer and a axe too to do everything. But okay, let's repair this. I'm not gonna take that, that, or that, or that. Yeah, let's keep that. I don't think we'll need it again for the rest of this POI. But let's just in case. Just in case, we'll keep it with us. OK, 
Okay, we got a light and a switch. I'm not exactly sure what that switch just did, but we activated it. I will take that. Okay, that door remains locked, so let's go back this way. Oh, we got a green light and a couple of these things opened up. Uh, I don't see any reason to go down here, though. Okay, let's try this one. Once again, we're going to do this the smart and easy way. Because we can. Yeah, I'm sorry, bud. We'll get you some food as soon as we're done with this. Um, Other than a trash all the way at the bottom here, again, don't see other, any other reason to come down here. But let's look in the trash. And we will grab those two things. And this pretty much gets us back to here, where we were earlier. But we didn't go this way. Alright, we have a trash up here. Uh, that will sell. But doesn't look like... Well, let's go down this way. Maybe we do go this way. Ah, satchel. Nice. Okay, so we got that part done. Okay, that just opens up out to there. Okay, so it's saying the Zombo that we have to kill is down below. So I'm thinking it's going to be down this way. What? Door's locked. Nothing in there. This door's unlocked. There's a zombo right there. Return to trader. We got it done. <laughs> All right. Okay, so in here we got a trash. Which we're not going to do anything with. Nothing else. Let's go up here. And up here. And a trash. Um. Fat loots? Where's the fat loots in this place? Where's the fat loots in this place? Is it in one of these silos? That's the only other thing I can think of, because I think we've covered everything else. All right, let's go. Let's go recheck the silos, I guess. Okay, there's nothing down here. We've been in here and we opened that or pushed that button and it did something that I don't know what it did. Oh, okay, here's something different. Well, that leads to a backpack. Oh, uh, we'll take that stuff. Oh, for goodness sakes. You know what? Screw that. Let's go back this way. I don't so oh, shit. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, we didn't get hurt though. I don't see anything down there. Nothing down there. Our poor guy's like just starving to death here. I'm sure we looked down there. This is the only one I silo I think we haven't looked in, so let's break this open and see what's in there. Um, that's the one that has the damn backpack in it. 
All right, I guess this place doesn't. Oh shit! <laughs> I guess this place doesn't have any fat loots in it. Um, I, I I can't think of any place else that we didn't already look. We've been up on the roof. I guess we've been up on the roof. We've been inside there. We've been in through here. No fat loots in here. Checked all the silos. Actually, here, yeah, let's just go this way. We came down this way. Got, oh shit, got the satchel. That just seems unusual. I mean, I've never not known a POI in this game to not have fat loots. Seems really unusual, but I don't know. I don't know what to do. <laughs> um. Okay, let's kill this guy. Okay, well. You guys, let me know in the comments what I'm if I'm missing something here. Um, but you know we're almost out of time. It's getting late, and I want to get the the quest turn in done at least. So, but yeah, I can't find any fat loots in this place. So that kind of sucks. All right. Anyway, let's um let's go ahead and head back to the trader and do our turn in. Okay, you're gonna give us a green hunting knife or two antibiotics. Mm, I don't have any antibiotics at all, but a green hunting knife would be nice. It's not that much better than what we have, honestly, though. <laughs> it's just not really. I think I'm gonna take the antibiotics. I think I am. Okay, um, so you got a clear zombos. I really admire you, friend. Isn't that the same damn one we tried? Okay, you know what? Let's take it again and just see if it, it actually works this time. If it doesn't, you know, then we cancel it and do something different. Okay, I'm going back to the house. I got to get some food. Desperately got to get some food. Uh, so we're going to do that. And then um, it's too late for us to really do anything else at this point. Uh, we will do some night quests, but I don't feel like I'm quite ready to do that yet. I think I want to get a little bit better geared. A little bit better skilled up before we attempt a night quest. So I'm going to hang out here at the house tonight, you guys. And then I will meet you in the morning. And we'll go back to that same place again and see if the quest marker is actually working now. Uh, oh, shit. I forgot to sell a couple things to him. But, you know, we'll, we'll do it later. I was going to sell this and this and this and this and that. Uh, to the tr and this to the trader. So we'll just leave that stuff in there. We'll worry about it in the morning because I've got to get something to eat. All right, guys. I'll see you in the morning and we'll go from there. All right, guys. It is the next morning. I stopped off and uh, went to the donut shop vending machine. Got a few cans of food. Took that back to the base. Uh, we spent the night mining um, down at Bedrock, and I did find a lead vein, so we got some lead going. So that's good. And, yeah, so let's put this money back in here. This is all stuff we're going to sell to the trader uh, later on when they open up. But let's go ahead and get this quest done. So this is a clear quest. I believe I've already looted all the stuff in here. Uh, you know what I think I will do, though, is let's take this car apart, because then we'll get, a, we'll get another one afterwards. All right, the other thing I think I want to do, too, is a drop chest. Let's go ahead and start that. We'll put the tr uh, chest out here on the road, though, because we're not going to have enough room for this, especially since the uh, mini bike, or, I mean, the bicycle's already full. Uh, so let's put all this stuff in here. I think I'm going to keep the wrench in here, too, and anything in the house, like radiators and stuff that I might want to wrench, I'll, I'll do that later off camera. Um, let's keep the lock picks in here. If we run into any safes, I can come back out and grab those later. Same thing with cobblestone. We're going to need the axe and the pick to break walls. We want this for, uh, repairing. Um, so yeah, we'll put that, put those there. 
And let's keep the food. Uh, we're doing pretty good on, on food and hydration. Let's actually eat another one of those. I made a bunch of cornbreads from all the corn that we got. We'll actually take two of those. And then another drink of this because it does make us a little bit thirsty, which is fine. We can handle that. Makes kind of makes sense. And I think we want to take everything else with us uh, that we have. Okay, let's do this. Make sure all of our weapons are loaded here. Looks like they are. Okay. We're probably going to have a Zeke in the garage if I remember right. Okay, let's just put that stuff in here too. And yeah, like I said, I'll come back here later off camera and get all the cobble and do all that stuff. Let's just get the quest going uh, for now. There's going to be a Zom right there. I see his hand. It's a a uh, construction worker. Let's soften him up a little bit. Oh, guess that hit the edge of the thing. Try it again. There we go. Oh, we missed. All right, we can take a couple hits. We don't want to take a ton of hits, but we can take a couple hits. So, yeah, basic looting we'll do later. Um, we'll get the we'll get the good stuff though right away. Let's just use this to get picked out up. Just trying to see if something's going to jump at us from up above because Alpha 20 likes to have stuff to jump at you from up above. Okay, let's check this closet here. And we got an Egger. Pop him right in the noggin. Looks like we got a couple. So let's upgrade this one level just to make it a little tougher. And we'll take these guys out. Off with his head. Edgar's going to do the little crawly crawl thing. Okay. Get rid of that. The bad thing about upgrading is that I can't pick him back up, but that's all right. Let's just check this. Uh, I'm going to leave the bone in there. Um, we might as well look in here, too. Oh, look at that. Okay. Perception shades. Uh, do we have... I don't think we have any shades on. All right, nice. So we will wear those and definitely hang on to them for, uh, you know, possible quicker levels later for, you know, the skill tree and that sort of thing. Okay, everything's out of there. I'll get the brass and the cobble and all that later, like I've already said a couple times, so I guess I don't need to keep repeating myself, right? <laughs> That's probably worth taking and selling. Let's check for safes. Any zombie doodles from behind here? No. How about some mineral water? All right. Uh, you know what? Actually, no. Easy to make. Super easy to make. There's a trash. We might as well check it. Nope. Not taking that. Okay. So chances are there's going to be a Zikaru in here. Another Edgar. Why, why does it always got to be the Eggers, man? All right. Well, let's take him out. That's what I call taking him out. Okay. So both of those doors are closed, so we can't get anything immediately jumping on our, our head. Let's check this. Uh, yeah, we'll hang on to that, I guess. If we need it before... I'll take that, that, and I'll eat this. I don't care about the golden rod. Is this an upgrade for us? It sure is. Nice. Okay. That will sell. I mean, we could sell this too for a nice price, but, um, no, I think I'd rather, oh, that's just a normal jacket though. That's not the run jacket. Yeah. I, th I think we'll keep the, the poncho on then and we'll just sell the jacket. Okay. That door's locked. So I think we got to go this way. Any zombie doodles in here? Okay, what about in here? All clear. 
Okay, let's check this duffel bag. Yeah, I'll take that stuff. You know, actually, I'll take this, too, because, um, you know, with vitamins, that actually becomes a reasonably good food item. Okay, so we have a couple of doors we can sneak into if we need to make a hasty retreat. Let's start heading upstairs here. Okay, there's an egger and there's a jiggly. Um, can we get, we have a better chance of getting him without her than the other way around, I think. So let's see if we can make that happen. Okay, let's just kind of quietly go downstairs. All right, I think we pulled that one off, all right? We'll just put a normal frame down here. Well, I think we got Jiggly's attention. That's all right, we're ready for her. Come on, Jiggles. Uh, Jiggles, there you go. That's good, girl. She did, he did, and they didn't even touch the frames. It's amazing. Okay, we should be good to come up here in the immediate part. There's a couple doors here and a sports bag. Let's see what's in here. That's a pretty nice shirt, but we got a BDU, which is generally going to be better. Um, so we'll probably just end up... Yeah, let's just scrap it for cloth. It's not even worth really selling, I don't think. I mean, if I had plenty of inventory space, it would be, but I don't have plenty of inventory space. Zombos? Probably not, because I don't see any red dots. Let's just repair that in case we need to use it later, and then we'll check the bathroom here. Don't care about that. Uh, I'll take that. Don't need the lead because we have a lead mine right underneath the house now. I will take that stuff. Nice. So we got a honey. Yeah, we'll take the water. Uh, scrap both of those. Uh, scrap? Wait, what? Why can't I scrap that? There's no... There's no S key to scrap. Oh, because it's already scrapped. Duh. <laughs> yeah, moving right along. Anyway, okay. That will take... Yeah, we'll take the feathers too. Might as well. A little bit of extra cloth, and then we've got... Um, we got a toilet here. Toilet pistol? Nope, no toilet pistol. And a trash in here. Okay. Uh, we don't want that. We don't want that. I'm going to hang on to everything else for the moment. And yeah, okay. We can always run back downstairs too. If we need to and, uh, you know, put stuff in the chest if, if it comes to that. All right. Anybody in the kitchen? Don't think so. Okay. Let's quickly loot in here. Okay, I think that's it. Uh, for this, let's head on upstairs. This brings us up into an attic. And it looks like there's a crawler over there. Alright, he's dead. Let's check the nightstand. Any other zombos up here? Getting lots of glue. Oh no. Really? A drop down situation? That's the. That, that never goes good. 
Are there any zombies in these closets? Oh man, I don't I don't know you guys. This is you know what's gonna happen, right? We're gonna drop down there and we're gonna get rushed. Oh shit. You know, hmm. Let's see if we can find a a safer way in there. So that's on this the east end of the house. Let's go back down through here. Uh I wonder if it's this room here. Yeah, I'll bet you it is. Okay, let's uh let's bust in through here. Okay, so this just comes out to a hallway. Nope, not taking that. That door is unlocked and that door is unlocked. So one of these leads out into this hallway. Let's just try this one first. That might have been the door we were supposed to come out of. I don't see a zombadoodle in there. Oh, okay, yeah, I saw that hole in the wall. So that's it's the room in there that we were supposed to jump through. Okay, no zombies in there. Okay, so we got a Zeker here. Can he come out this way? Yeah, it looks like he can. Yeah, see, those are the dudes that would have jumped us if we would have come that way. Okay. Then we beat the system on that one. I'm not not quite yet in a, at a place where I could have handled that easily. I probably, well, I might have survived it, but I might not have either, right? So, yeah, that's where we would have jumped down. Uh, let's check these cupboards here. Uh, tough guy? Yes. This will give us fort. I'd rather have those on than the perceptions, but we'll definitely keep the perceptions too. Okay, I guess that's it for in here. Let's go back out this way and into this room. Got a Darlene there and another dot that way. Return to Trader. All right, we did it. We did it, ladies and gentlemen. Awesome. Okay. Uh, fat loot's room, too. Let's see what's in here. Some foul trash. We'll take the potato seeds for later. Uh, nice, nice. Okay, we'll grab that. Check this stuff here. N nothing good. Uh, I'm going to take those two things. Uh, that we can just scrap, and I'm not going to take the water. Okay, uh, drop a bomb. Sprinting power attacks have a high chance of knocking down your opponent. Nice. Yeah, I want to try hand-to-hand -hand at some point in this playthrough. That is my intention. Good. I'll take all that, and we even have some knuckle wraps to do the hand-to-hand -hand with if we don't find something better before then. All right, guys, that is it. I'm going to, um, I'll meet you guys back at the trader, but I'm going to harvest, you know, all the cobblestone and some of the other resources uh, like this for brass um, in here. And then I'll meet you guys back at the trader and we will uh, go from there. Okay, so see you in a bit. All right, guys, we are at the trader. Let's grab all of the stuff out of here. Check the vending machine. Oh, uh, we will take the smoothie, and I think that's it. I mean, I could do sugar butts, but we don't have anything super high valuable at this point, or super high, super high value at this point. Greetings, stranger. Greetings, stranger. Here you go, friend. Robotic Here sledge or more herbal Just antibiotics. Hmm. Well, we did get. Did we? No, I don't. 
Did we get antibiotics last time? I think we did. I can't remember for sure, though. It's actually been um, the next day for me since I recorded the first part of this episode. Eh, man. I mean, this is useful. It is useful, but I kind of like to have those, I think. So, yeah, that's what we're going to do. All right. Um, let's take a look at your inventory. All right. We want to sell some things to you. So we should actually repair this before we sell it. We don't want to sell that. Let's sell this, this, and this, and all of this. Um, that, and that, and that, and that. And these. And yeah, we just need pipes to repair those. You come back sometime. So we should, because very cheap to repair, and it'll give us a little bit more money. Um, okay. Oh, I forgot to take the next quest from him. Silly me. Did we look at his inventory? I th think we did. It's a nice hunting rifle, but out out of our uh, range, we could. You know what, though, we could, I could make a nine mil because I know how to make a nine mil. For that matter, I could also make a shotgun. Does he have any shotgun parts? Not there. But he does have handgun parts. Hmm. Thanks anyway. All right, what do I need to make there. a pistol? I need six handgun parts. Everything else is easy. Oh, shoot. You only have five, though, man. What the hell? That's going to set us back 2,000. And it's not going to give us everything we need. But, I mean, we can still find more or check. I could go check Trader Gen, too. Eh, I don't know. That's... Okay, he restocks on day 13. So I'm going to I'm gonna hold off on that. I'm not going to do it right this moment. Still forgot to get a job from him. <laughs> okay, jobs. Fetch and clears. Fetches, restore powers, clear zombos. Um, uh, what are, where's this? Post office. All right, yeah, let's try that one. God bless you. All right, guys. Well, I think that is it for this episode. So I think we'll wrap things up here. I'm going to go get the loot from uh, our previous one and get that kind of all situated. And then we'll start up the next episode and we'll do uh, the post office clear quest. So hope you guys enjoyed the episode. If you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. We'll leave a comment and share the video. And we'll catch you all in the next episode. Bye-bye.